Marty, just heard you say you can't remember the last time we had severe weather like this three days in a row. I was just talking to Steve George. Mm -hmm. um, I mean, we, we, we have had alerts two or three days in a row. Sure. And I mean where it's almost guaranteed to happen. It's very unscientific, just, you know, going back in my own mind. Mm -hmm. But at best, very few and far between. Very few. Far between. Folks, excuse the voice for a second. I was cleaning up debris in my yard last night until 10 o'clock. I mean, dealing with branches as thick as your arm, 10 feet long, and then all of a sudden, halfway through, I realized wet pollen is all over me. Well, we may have a redo today. 80 degrees right now. That's going to be Andy Pena. By the way, who works with rescued horses? Met Andy Sussman a couple weeks ago. Andy Payne and Boring is looking at 80 steamy degrees. Dave Hartman and Adina, 84. Rick Ladd, Calor, 86. And the Shockers in Catonsville, 83 degrees. On TVO right now, 87. 50% humidity, a variable, variable breeze at 7. Barometers at 2977. So what we want to do is show you temps, then we'll launch into the heat index. Again, we've taken the uh, forecast high this day up to 89 degrees. That had been 84. That current 87 feels more like 90 here on TV Hill and in Annapolis. Around the Beltway, what we're talking about, our temperatures right now primarily in the low 80s. Remember, TV Hill is an urban island, basically so is Annapolis. But nonetheless, all these temperatures are going to be rising today. Uh, uh, 85 Columbia, 82 Catonsville, 83 Townsend, 82 Dundalk, 85 degrees in Glen Burnie. Nothing going on right now, but not all that far away, skirting north of the Mason-Dixon line. Showers and now a couple thunderstorms approaching Cumberland from the west and, the, uh, and passing by to the north. Just an indication of the instability in the atmosphere needing deflection. And again, earlier, this slight uh, uh, borderline between slight and marginal was right at D.C. It has now dropped down to almost Patuxent River naval air and including Ocean City. This will be, be over, said, and done with, you know, once we get into the nighttime hours. By tomorrow afternoon, another round of showers may try and blossom down to the south. Saturday is still looking pretty good, but Sunday there could be some more showers in the region. So here's that updated forecast. A few strong thunderstorms. 89, and it's not, you know, oh, there's a chance. We'll see how it goes. Same scenario as the past two days. 89 degrees is going to be the high overnight. Life does calm down some. 65 will be the low. Nicole? All right, Marty, we'll be watching the weather. No choice. Thank you. Bye -bye.